Hello and welcome to this tutorial. In today's video we will go through how we make a function block like AT on timer block similar to the one we use in Siemens TIA portal. First let's create a new project. Then to make a function block we right click on program and add new data then choose function block. I will first add my labels. We will need two input, two output, one timer, and one constant label that should always be true. Now that our labels are done we can go to the program and make some programming. This is the code needed for AT on timer block. Let's compile it and go to the main program block. I will now add the function block to my main program. Just drag the function block in. I will add one memory bit to my an input and an application instruction to PT and add a value for how long the block should count for. On the output I will use Y0 from my PLC. And on ET I will just add a tag that can keep track of the elapsed time. Let's download the program and test it out. The block will count up for the value we give it and turn on once it reached the set value. Then if we turn the in input off it turn off the output. I will now add two more blocks and give them different in value and to some other outputs on the PLC. Let's download and test this out.
As you can see they turn on depending on which preset value we given them. Thank you for watching this tutorial. If you liked the video give it a thumbs up and subscribe.